Hey hello guys, it's How to Tag Simplified back again with another easy tutorial and today I'm going to show you uh, how to fix it when Watering Waves is uh, stuck on verifying the game files. Now the first thing that we want to do is actually quit the uh, Watering Waves process in the background. So simply go to the hidden icons in the bottom right of the screen, right click the Watering Waves uh, icon, simply exit it and as you can see we're stuck right here. Now from there we go to the search bar and we go to the Windows Defender Firewall. Now. We open up the control panel because sometimes the firewall is interfering with the integrity of the game files. Now from there we go to allow app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall, press a W and this will open up the uh, W applications. Now we look for watering waves. As you can see right here, simply uh, select both of them. First press change settings and now we can um, make sure that the private and the public network is enabled as you can see right here allow it when it asks you to allow it to apply it and from there if you can't find a uh, watering waves you can allow another app simply browse and look for uh, the watering waves application to allow the exe file now what you could also do if this didn't fix your issue, you could simply head down to the Epic Games Launcher right here and from there go into the library and from there uh, go to the Watering Waves application, go to the three dots and inside the three dots we go to manage. Now inside manage uh, you can find the installation button and here we can find the installation location. Now as you can see right here we have a load of options to choose from. Now what we want, we want to look for the Watering Waves game right here. Simply open up the folder and here we have the Watering Waves.exe. Now right click this, go to properties, go to compatibility mode and run this program as administrator. Simply press apply, press OK. You could also try if this didn't work, go to the compatibility mode once again and disable the full screen optimizations. This will sometimes work as well. And from there, um, try to restart your computer and try it again. Now you could also update your Windows settings and that should fix your issues. Now, if you still have other questions regarding this tutorial, leave them in the comments down below. I would highly appreciate it if you could subscribe to my YouTube channel if this content has helped you. And thanks for watching. 